Hey, how's it going? This is Deontay Bird. You know, a lot of people are being called back to work, and a lot of jobs are saying, hey, look, we've opened our doors back. We want our employees back. Once you guys work and come back in with the right attitude, we're moving forward. And I understand everybody going back with mixed emotions. Some people come back to work off of may have been laid off. They were making a certain amount of money while being laid off, and they may be going back to a job with reduced wages or, you know, things may be back to normal, but you're feeling okay. But I do want to tell everyone that every business is going through different things. And you're going to have some companies that have brought people back, but they're still on shaky ground. They don't know where they're going. They don't know what they'll be doing. And I'm not telling people to quit their jobs or leave before anything gets well. I'm just saying one word, propel. The thing of it is you can't wait for someone to, to fire you. Be prepared. A lot, and I'm not saying to just, you know, you know, jump off board because you think things are going to get bad. When I say prepare, I mean, you know, work on your resume. Look at job boards. You can make some kind of applications. A lot of times when you apply to certain jobs, especially if it's a stable company, especially dealing with the government or bigger firms, it may be a two or three month period or process rather uh, but to see how long it gets done. And you're not, you know, moving out of control or jumping the gun or anything. You're just getting ready just in case because things do happen because people can bring you back into a situation and a company can think everything's going to be fine, but if things don't get to the proper uptick, you know, the company is going to make decisions. And we all know every company, their main goal is to make a profit. Now, you have some that go from a, um, they're very uh, you know, uh, empathetic, and they care about their employees and everything, and they try to string it along as much as possible, but they're not going to let the ship sink to keep you afloat. So, again, just prepare. You know, look at your resume if you haven't created one. You know, make the updated revisions or anything to it. A lot of times when you haven't looked or did anything with your resume in years, you've totally forgotten all the accomplishments you've had that, you know, all of a sudden you're trying to figure out what's going on. So just kind of, you know, look at your resume, touch up, make all the necessary updates. Take a look and see what's out there, what's out there in your immediate area. Some of the things that you may be interested in, they're nowhere near located near you. So you may want to just say, hey, if I got to kind of, you know, go a little bit, a little bigger distance away from my home, that may be possible. Or, you know, relocation may be on the option. You know, again, we're just being proactive looking. Um, kind of see what, what kind of agencies are out there, what agencies are hiring, what's the current, uh, you know, for the market, what, what they're paying right now, you know. Are you below the market in terms of what again if you come out there right now looking? Or you be okay. Will you be paying way be paid way more than what you're being paid now? Just be proactive to kind of find out what's going on. We don't want to be reactive. And we definitely don't want to be reactive off another person's decision. So again, I'm not saying jump the gun and you know, leave the job. I'm just saying again, one word prepare. This is Deontay Bird, host of Change Your Lives. Make sure you go to Change Your Life, hosted by yours truly on YouTube, subscribe to the YouTube channel, over 200 videos listed, a lot of great information where we talk about motivation, personal development, and being the best you possible. Our show comes on every Thursday, 8 p.m., streaming live uh, off YouTube. I look forward to uh, hearing back from you guys. Take care. Goodbye.